headed in the right direction on this one. Um, over here, we have the graph uh, y equals 2 minus 2x squared, uh, bounded by the line y equals 0, which is the x-axis. And we're told that every cross-section parallel to the x-axis uh, of this solid is a triangle that has the, a height that's the same length as the base. So here we're visualizing a top view of this solid. Now if we vi visualize a side view, one of the cross sections, like this base would be 2. So this height would be 2. So the area of that triangle is 1 half the base times the height. And that's the case of all of these lines that are parallel to the x-axis, that the triangle formed will have a height that's the same as the length of that base. So this is called volume by slicing. We would like to find a formula for the area of each of these triangles, depending on where we are along the y-axis between 0 and 2. So here's the original function. I need to get the x in terms of y so that I can get this distance right here. And then if I double that, I'll have a formula for the base. So I've solved this for x right here. And here's what x equals. It either equals plus or minus the square root of 2 minus y over 2. So we could say that uh, this distance is this x coordinate, which is 2 square root of 2 minus y over 2 minus a negative square root of 2 minus y over 2. Or we could just double this distance right here, which is what I've done here. So that is a formula for the base of each triangle as we move along the y-axis from 0 to 2. And then the formula for the area of each cross-section is 1 half the base times the height. Well, and because the base and the height are equal, I could have just written this as the quantity squared. But I wrote it this way for emphasis. But when you simplify it, you get this. 2 minus y. So that is the formula for the area of each triangle, depending upon where we are along the y-axis. And the volume of the solid generated is given by this formula. Evaluate the definite integral from 0 to 2 of a of y dy. I'll leave that to you. Okay, hope that helped. If you have any questions, post a comment.